Hey, welcome to Virginia Creeping Outdoors. Today we're out here picking raspberries. And they are all over the place. This up in here has already been picked. But back in through there, haven't got there yet. And I'm running out of time. So I'm going to have to come back and get those. Came up here today. This is June, not June, July 5th. And I uh, was looking for blackberries. Typically I find blackberries somewhere around June 20th, but they're not exactly ripe at this point. So I kept seeing these red berries, passing them by thinking it was blackberry that just weren't ripe. And then I finally checked and saw that they were raspberries. So right now I've got about a gallon and a half and gonna make a good cobbler. So stick around for that. Hey, as promised, little raspberry cobbler. And what I've done is I've gone on cooks.com. It's a basic recipe. And it calls for white cake mix, a can of Sprite or 7-Up. We're going to use ginger ale. And with the raspberries, I've got about five cups of raspberries and it calls for cake mix and we're going to use blueberry muffin mix because that's what we got on hand because the recipe is nothing more than a suggestion and we're going to be brave and go ahead and just do this so to open the blueberry muffin mix. We'll pour that into a mixing pan. Go with two packs. It's generic Boo Ryan. Okay, whatever. Got it on hand. And it opens really wonderfully. Ginger ale. Just one can. And then we're going to whisk that up. And you're not supposed to over mix this, so don't go too crazy. And then got the Dutch oven, got it good and greased up. And put our berries in there, distribute them evenly ish, and then we'll take the batter and pour it over top. And that's what we got. That's what it looks like. The pan's nice and greased. And this recipe calls for, uh, it's for cooking by coals, but that's kind of insignificant these days because the coals are different and we're going to put it in the oven anyway. So basically for the baking instructions, we're going to go off of what's on the package of the muffin mix, which calls for 425. We're going to be doing it at 400 and... It says to bake 14 to 17 minutes and you're basically just going to want to like check it every now and then and look for it to be golden brown. 
and that's what we're going to do because it's always just a suggestion and we're just going to go for it and hopefully my tripod will set up correctly have the oven it's already preheated and Preheated the bottom oven, which is bigger, like a pro. <laughs> anyway, it's cooking, so stick around. Well, had a little camera error going on with the GoPro. Ended up taking a picture for the final video so I have to do another video to let you know how it went um, for the raspberry cobbler I preheated the oven I didn't preheat the Dutch oven which is a large cast iron piece of metal so it took a lot longer than I had thought you know which is where I always say you have to know a little bit about cooking when you try these things whether you're doing it on a fire or any oven stove top whatever um, and it was is basically watching for it making sure that it was a uh, golden brown and that ended up taking somewhere around 45 minutes and it really turned out pretty darn good the uh, the uh, blueberry muffin mix worked fine um, added a nice little blueberry flavor to it and nobody complained it's all gone and you can give it a try take my mistakes into consideration and thanks for watching don't forget to like and subscribe